What's going on guys, welcome to my tutorial on Adobe Photoshop CS6. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to use some new blur effects. This is pretty cool with Adobe Photoshop because we have a lot of options where we can control some blur. And I'm going to select Field Blur for my first option here. I'm going to select another point and lower the blur. And you can see already that it's affecting only one point in the picture. And then we can take another point over here and I'm going to lower the blur. It gives you some pretty cool options when you're making changes to your picture and adding blur. Now the next blur option we have here is called iris blur. We can change the shape over here by clicking this box and moving it. Or we can change the size. You can also rotate it over here. And we can make the adjustments on the side for the blur. And you see that the circle surrounds the dog and we can select OK. And that's pretty cool. So that's two of the blurs and then we can go over here to filter blur and select tilt shift. And this is another new blur filter, and we can come over here and make adjustments. You can also change things over here with the lighting of the blur. So I guess my favorite out of all of them is the iris blur because we just have more control over it. I think it gives you the nicest look if you're looking to, you know, add some blur. Say we want just the dogs to be shown. You could do something like that. Whatever you want to do with the picture, but that gives you an idea of the new blur features in Adobe Photoshop CS6. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.